to the Walla Walla Suites pregame show presented by Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram Walla Walla and the Sweet Onion Farmers of Walla Walla. I'm here with Suites player Zach Penrod. Zach, the team had a crazy game to, to close out the series against Corvallis. You guys won the game 10 to 9, but it was a roller coaster of a game. You know, obviously them just coming, coming back, scoring five runs late. Just kind of take me through what was the emotion like in the dugout for you guys as Corvallis was coming back and you guys were trying to hold them off. Uh, it was pretty crazy. Um, obviously, like when we started losing runs and stuff like that, it, it kind of it started to get a little close and a closer than we wanted. Made us a little bit nervous, but I, I was really happy with the our way our offense worked. We came back, battled hard, and we got that run. So, yeah, definitely it needed needed that one run in there in the in the bottom of the sixth uh, to kind of get that extra seal the deal kind of victory. And so, obviously, for you, you had four RBIs in the game. You know, what were you seeing in your in your plate appearances that made you um, you know hit so well in the game? Well, uh, we really talked about being a little bit more aggressive in our approaches. And so we, we worked really hard on and battling early, getting the pitch we wanted and driving it. And I feel like we worked as a team. We got that big hit from Josh at the beginning of the game, and that was huge. Uh, in my at-bats, personally, I was seeing the ball pretty well that night. And so it was just really easy to just, you know, put the bat on the ball and make something happen. Yeah, a lot of really great pieces of hitting. Again, the one off the wall. Um, and so just kind of with that, you know, I mean, you obviously, you know, showed up in a big way offensively, but so did the rest of the team. What was it really that you think that, that really kind of helped get this team over the hump and kind of get that big offensive day that you guys have been looking for? Uh, I think after losing 2-1, I think we had like four hits in the first game. It kind of shook us a little bit, like realizing that Corvallis is a pretty good team and we really need to beat these guys. And so in that second game, all we really needed was that one hit to push us over. And we finally got it. And I think that, you know, hits are contagious. And so they just kind of caught on and everybody just started hitting really well. Yeah, I've been saying the same thing. It, it's contagious, right? When when the guys are hitting well, everyone's seemingly going to do it. When the guys are kind of slowing down, you know, it, it's going to kind of just run through the lineup. But obviously, great to see that contagion working in the right way that time and you guys having a big day offensively. Hopefully, you guys keep it rolling going forward. And, and so today here, you're getting the day off. But what do the, the Sweets need to do today here to get the victory against the Highline Bears? Uh, I really think we just need to stay aggressive in our approaches at the plate. I think our pitching is always going to be there. We got a lot of guys that can throw strikes. And so I think that if we just keep rolling with our bats, we're going to be just fine. Going into the series against Bend, obviously, it's an important series. So I think we just need to carry some momentum from last night or from Sunday into these games and we'll roll. Definitely. Talking with Zach Penrod of the Walla Walla Suites here on the Walla Walla Suites pregame show presented by Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram Walla Walla in the Sweet Onion Farmers Walla Walla. Zach, thanks for taking some time to talk to us, man. And hey, good luck out there today. Thank you.